hip hip cheerio friends your favorite let's player i hope kefka floyd back with another episode of let's play return to castle wolfenstein this episode of let's play to return to castle wolfenstein we'll be investigating the secret nazi communications base we've just destroyed the rocket the rocket base does not seem to be in good shape yeah it's, it's burning up that's not good so what we have to do now is stop the Nazi communications before we get to the airfield. Let's see. Up there, we've got somebody on a manned MG-42. be a good idea to kill him. So we can go and use the manned MG-42 for ourselves. Oh, using their own weapons against them. It is so delicious. Not in an ironic sense. It's just delicious. All right. Running away, are you? We don't take running away very kindly here. Gets you shot. Somebody sounded the alarm, which is bad news for us. It means that more Nazis will be on the way. I don't think there's any secrets in here, so we'll just have to go up, climb this ladder, and hit the manned MG-42, where a stream of Nazis will be coming directly at us, right into my line of fire. Just gotta give it a minute. You can see there's a couple over there. Come on, Nazis. You know you want to. There they are. I don't know why they didn't put the overheating mechanism in the single-player MG42s. It really should be there, just like it is in the multiplayer, but you honestly rarely get to use the MG42s, so they probably just figured to let you have some fun instead. I don't know why I'm using the Sten here either, probably because I'm trying to get either accuracy or some other kind of bonus, but I clearly get in trouble with overheating from time to time. Alright, oh. Is there a Nazi up there? Yes. So the thing to do here is destroy this spotlight, because that spotlight... Whoa! Rocket launcher! Yes, you start seeing more dangerous soldiers around this time, some of them with Panzerfausts and sniper scopes. They will hurt, so stay away from them. Anyway, the reason you want to get rid of those spotlights is because if that moving spotlight sees you, it'll sound the alarm and send more Nazis. That looks like we can't go in there, so we'll go in here instead. Maybe there'll be something useful. Hmm. Looks like it's a medic's house. According to the Geneva Convention, I shouldn't be interfering with medics. Very helpful here. Took care of all those guys. Wow. Save me some bullets, too. So, yes, right here is one of the main parts you'd be seeing from MP Base. MP Base, or Communique, is my favorite map in Return to Castle Wolfenstein multiplayer. It's my favorite for a variety of reasons. Mainly because it's fairly short. You know, it doesn't take too long to uh, complete the objectives. It has varied elevations, so there is a way to get, you know, some high ground here and there. It has only one objective, and that's to blow up the radar tower. Actually, no, that's not true. There's technically two objectives, because there's two radar towers you have to blow up in the multiplayer version. While here in the single-player version, there's only one. But still, I suppose blowing up radar towers is about the same in terms of objectives. All oh, right. One thing you'll be noticing here is that the Nazis in this level tend to wear the trench coats that you'll see in multiplayer. They've gone out of their forest gear and are now in more of the stereotypical Nazi soldier garb, I guess. This secret passage brings us to the secret of the area. They give us a flak jacket, a helmet, a Panzerfaust. Hell yeah. We also got a box of ammo for our Mauser rifle. It's very good for us. We'll hang on to that Panzerfaust because I think we'll be needing it later. For now, let's just go take care of a couple Nazis here and there. Oh, dynamite. Yes, we need dynamite. Because we have to blow up the radar tower in single player too. Without dynamite, we can't do that. I just felt like blowing up those gas canisters. You know, excessive use of force. All right, time to mosey on over here. Wow, that was a long way for him to fall. 
One thing I have forgotten to mention, and we'll mention now, is that the Nazi soldiers in here, when you're either notified or when you die, tend to make sounds very similar to uh, what they did in the original cast, uh, imagine not Castle Wolfenstein, but Wolf 3D. You know, they'll call you a Schweinhund. They'll call out the Americaner. Um, when you kill them, they'll say, my Lieben, mein Gott, things like that. It's just a very nice nod to the past. I, for one, enjoyed it. Let's see, what's in here? Gold bar. They're just leaving it out for me to get. It doesn't even take any effort. I like that. Okay, that's just a radio. I don't know why I'm kicking the radio, other than to show you that you can kick the radio and it explodes in a very Hollywood fashion. I didn't know radios could explode. I guess I learned something new every day. Well, he's just waiting there to die. Stupid idiot. Okay, so over here we're going to be reaching the radar installation. Let's see. Where is the radar installation? It's over there, actually. That's the direction we need to go. Not where I was just going. Let's see. There's got to be a few Nazis over here, I think. Like, there's one in the radar tower. Which we need to take care of before we throw the dynamite in there. Huh. Actually, no, he's not there. This makes it too easy. Time to set our dynamite and get the hell out. Now, unlike multiplayer, you don't need to arm dynamite with pliers. You just hold it, it sets a timer, and kablooey! Let's see. There we go. Right on schedule. That's a flashy explosion, if I do say so. Just checking my notebook, seeing that that is, in fact, what we needed to do. These guys are dumb enough to come check out what happened and get themselves killed. Take that, Nazis. Alright, what's going on in here? Hmm, I think this is the exit to the next level of the game. Oh, looks like we got some intel here. Let's take a look. Hmm. Yes! Prolonged exposure to radiation without any sort of shielding is not bad for you? I'd like to know what doctor you have working for you, Nazis. Everybody knows that shit's bad for you. Hey, I'm taking some real damage there. See, just some more radar installations. Nothing really of note here. Although you can open this and turn that, which causes something to explode in the next room. I think it just kills some Nazis so that we don't have to expend any bullets. This door just brings you back outside, doesn't really do anything for us. But we're going to go down this hallway, which will take us out of the radar installation and to the airfield. So join us next time on Let's Play Return to Castle Wolfenstein, when we'll be seeing Nazi experimental jet airplanes. Ooh. Catch you later.